Good day, brothers and sisters. Another day to spend with the Lord. Come, let us listen and reflect on His Word. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Jesus journeyed to a city called Nain, and his disciples and a large crowd accompanied him. As he drew near to the gate of the city, a man who had died was being carried out, the only son of his mother, and she was a widow. A large crowd from the city was with her. When the Lord saw her, he was moved with pity for her and said to her, Do not weep. He stepped forward and touched the coffin. At this the bearers halted, and he said, Young man, I tell you, arise. The dead man sat up and began to speak, and Jesus gave him to his mother. Fear seized them all, and they glorified God, exclaiming, A great prophet has arisen in our midst, and God has visited his people. This report about him spread through the whole of Judea and all the surrounding region. The Gospel of the Lord He was moved with pity. After healing the centurion servant in Capernaum, Jesus goes to Nain, accompanied by his disciples and a large crowd walking the whole day. As he reaches the city, Jesus notices a funeral procession on the way. The people are going to bury the only son of a widow. Jesus knows what that means. The mother has just lost a loved one whom she relies on for her survival. She is forbidden to make a living according to their custom. She will survive by begging. Jesus is moved with pity and intervenes. He says, Young man, I tell you, arise. The man arises and reunites with his mother. Jesus shows his power to raise the dead, not just to heal the sick as he has done in Capernaum. The people glorify God. And cannot stop saying, A great prophet has arisen in our midst, and God has visited his people. Yes, the kingdom of God is taking hold of them as he moves from one place to another, showing compassion to the bereaved and power over death. 